Good morning you guys welcome back to another vlog the air just turned off in my apartment so probably sounds a little bit better now i'm gonna put you guys down i haven't ice rolled my face yet so i don't know why but i just like love to ice roll my face and talk to you guys i feel like i need to move the camera because the lighting is so weird waking up this morning i feel so much better today you guys this past week i filmed a video on it i was like getting my life together and i was overwhelmed at the beginning of the week because i had so many things to do on my to-do list and now i've like basically accomplished all of those and i just feel so relieved and i'm just really happy with the fact that i got a lot of it done so i'm just excited for this weekend tomorrow is brandon's birthday which is gonna be so fun tomorrow night he's actually going out to dinner with like his brothers his dad his uncle his like guy friends and so his mom actually planned a girls night for all of us and she was like i don't want like the boys to go do their thing and then us girls not have anything so i'm going out to dinner with like his mom his aunt his sister-in-laws and it's just gonna be a really nice time i can't remember the name of the restaurant so i'll just let you guys know what i end up or where we end up going with a check today i have a couple of things to do just to get ready for his birthday yesterday i already went to target and um picked up a few things but i need to run over to the strip and buy something i got his birthday present last week when i was in arizona with my mom so i have that like his main gift but there's something else that i want to get so i'm gonna go to caesar's palace i just bought a bag to put his gift in and then also some wrapping paper so i can wrap the other things and then actually i got a new candle this is for me it's not for brandon but it's the soy love candle in the i can't pronounce this something bamboo but it smells really good so i'll probably like this later today I already had some rice cakes earlier, so I'm not drinking this on an empty stomach, but I think I'm gonna make oatmeal right now. I'm just gonna start with boiling some water. I always make mine on the stove. Like, I do not care if it takes longer. my phone last night so i'm plugging it in right now because i literally only have six percent and i'm gonna do some makeup i just want to have something on my face today i love having these clips to pull my hair out of my face when i put my makeup on but i'm gonna do this relatively fast because i want to get going threw on a white tank and this blazer which is from princess polly it's the lioness one and then i have on some blue jeans and my new balance 550s with this bag so i am off i got some makeup on and i just left my hair how it is i kind of brushed through the curls so we're gonna head over to the strip and just run a couple of the errands that i have I just got home from shopping and I made avocado toast for lunch. I put some turkey bacon on there and then I also did everything bagel seasoning, microgreens, and some fresh lemon juice. I'm gonna turn on a YouTube video and sit and just enjoy it. Sometimes I feel like I will rush eating and just like try to do everything so fast and I'm trying to slow down a little bit. So I'm just going to enjoy my avocado toast, watch a little bit of a video. I just finished wrapping all of Brandon's birthday presents. I love how the blues look together. I had just enough paper to wrap all of these. So I got really lucky that I didn't have to go to the store and buy more. And then I put on my line shorts and a line tank. I have a black 
sweatshirt on because I'm gonna head to the gym and do my leg workout. I scheduled my sauna appointment for 5.30, so I'm gonna go there right after my workout and then I can just throw the sweats on. I need to grab my gym bag, my water, and then I'm ready to go. just got out of the shower and I had a really good afternoon. I did my leg workout and I got that done and then I went to the sauna and it was super relaxing. I already washed my face and I'm just doing a little bit of toner. This is the PCA Skin Nutrient Toner and I like to use this at night just to make sure that my skin is super clean gets off all of the any dirt or like bacteria that's still on your skin my products are honestly the same this one right here is the skin better science alpharet overnight cream and this is a retinol i only use this like twice a week but i haven't used it for a couple days so i'm doing it tonight i don't know i just don't really change my skincare that much which is why you guys always see me use the same things that's probably not very entertaining because i'm not like talking about new products but i personally think that it's way better for your skin to just use the same thing over and over and not switch up your skincare that much because that can cause like breakouts and acne and i mean i'm not like a dermatologist or an esthetician or anything but at least for me i think that it works better for me to just like constantly use the same stuff. This right here is the Skin Better Science Trio Rebalancing Moisturizer. I love this one. I do change my products sometimes, but I usually stick to like medical grade skincare or things that I know have worked for my skin. Like there's a couple different brands that I like and I'll just like rotate through those. Lastly, I'm just gonna do some of the Hyaluronic Acid PCA Skin Lip Booster. And that is my entire skincare for the night. I feel super clean. Right now I'm about to pack for Brandon's this weekend and I wanna have like a cute outfit for dinner tomorrow night. Other than that, like I'll just like grab some clothes. I have this black dress from White Fox. It's really cute, it has these slits on the side and it's kind of open in the back, but I'm gonna wear it with the blazer that I was wearing today over. And then I'm also gonna do these taller black boots. So I'll wear this for dinner tomorrow night. It's like a little bit dressier. And then on Sunday, I'm going to his parents' house for dinner. So I'm just going to bring a white t-shirt. This is actually dirty and I need to wash it. And then I'm going to do these trousers, which they're cute because they have a little slit on the feet. And then my black leather jacket from Princess Polly. And then for shoes, I'll just do these New Balance 550s. Hi you guys, happy Saturday. It's obviously the next day and I'm on my way to dinner right now. It's super bright and beautiful outside. It's 619 and our dinner reservation is at 630. We're eating at this place called La Strega and it's an Italian restaurant here and I'm super hungry. I haven't eaten for a couple hours. Brandon and I have had a really good day. I need to look at the directions because I'm like almost here. Um, we went to coffee this morning. We went to Badass, which is like our favorite place to get a coffee. And then we went for a walk, which was so nice. It was like a couple miles. And it's a walk we used to do a lot last like summer and spring. We haven't done it for a while because, well, I broke my toe in the fall. So we didn't really walk that much. And then it's been winter. So it was nice to go do that loop together. And we made breakfast. So we've had like a super good day. And now I'm like really looking forward to having a girl's night and doing dinner with his mom and his aunt and sister-in-laws and Brooke is going too. I don't know if I mentioned that to you guys the other day, but I always love when I get to see Brooke. So it's going to be fun. I'm kind of confused on where the restaurant is. The way that this is taking me is like super weird. Clearly I've never eaten here before. I was looking at the menu though and it looks so good. I think that I might get um, the br uh, Brenzino. Brandon said that I would really like that one because it's like a white fish and I've never had it before, but I've been eating like a lot of cod lately. So I might order that. Why am I so confused? This plaza is like, I don't know. I just found the restaurant finally. That was like so confusing and there is not a single parking spot. I wanted to put my jewelry on and I forgot. So I was doing it when 
I was driving and I have this bracelet. I did my makeup and then I have these rings on. I have no rings on this hand. <laughs> and then I have my um, bracelets on both arms and then I'm gonna use this clutch. So I'm all ready, I'm so excited. Maybe I'll show you guys um, the food that I ordered, but this is the outfit, just the dress, and then I have my tall boots on. got out of the shower and I did a little skincare my hair is already drying really fast but I um, really needed to wash it this morning because I wore it in a slick back bun yesterday and I had a lot of gel and it just was like really hard and stuck and it was also just like dirty I hadn't washed it for a few days I have been up for a little bit it's like around eight o'clock right now I'm gonna mostly have like a work day this morning at my apartment just kind of get some stuff done around here before I leave to go to the gym later I have a meeting with my financial advisor just like over zoom at 10 30 so i'm just kind of doing some stuff until i have that i put on this set from aritzia i have the jacket in i think it's the boyfriend cropped one then i just put on like a little white tank underneath and then the shorts which are the boyfriend like three inch length ones but it's super cute and comfy just to be casual today shining today I was just looking at the weather and I feel like it's actually starting to be spring and the weather is like turning to <laughs> warmer outside because well today it's only gonna be in the 50s but it says it on Sunday it's gonna be 73 and sunny out and I'm super excited because Sunday is actually Brandon's sister-in-law's baby shower I don't even know if I told you guys or not if she's pregnant but one of his brothers has two nephews and then now his other brother is having a girl so it's gonna be his first niece and I'm just like so excited for there to be like a little girl in the picture it'll be fun on Sunday to go I was just texting Lauren this morning and asking her if she can send me some cute pink dress ideas because I want to wear something pink for the shower and I just like need to order something because it's obviously this coming weekend. So I'm going to pick a dress or like a skirt and a top or something to wear for the shower this weekend. But anyways, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to fill my water and then get some work done. I just got off the phone. I had a meeting for like an hour and then I talked to my mom and now I'm getting like super hungry. So I'm gonna make something to eat, but everything has been going really good. So I'm gonna get some food and then I'm gonna sit back down at the computer and get a bunch of editing done. I started following this new girl and I really like her account. Her name is Sammy D Eats and you can see her profile right here but she has like so many good reels and recipes on here so i was looking at one of her toast ones because i got this um or i found a recipe from her that was like a toast that i made in one of my last vlogs and her account is just like so good she uses like a lot of the same things that i like to eat like the granola and the yogurt and whatnot so it's really easy for me to just recreate and i think that her recipes are also really simple she doesn't use a ton of ingredients which is really helpful so you can make them super fast i have some turkey bacon going right now and i'm going to do some toast with almond butter and i learned a trick over the weekend i haven't tried it yet but apparently when you get like natural peanut butters or almond butters they have 
like a lot of oil on the top and mine is always like so hard for me to stir and like get mixed together but I was told that if you flip it upside down you can kind of stir it like this and then you can leave it upside down in your refrigerator or even in your pantry and it will make the oil and everything like come together so I'm gonna try that because mine is always like so hard for me and I feel like I end up using like a lot of the top that's like oily and then it gets to the bottom and it's like rock hard and not like mixed right I did a little bit of the Siggy's plant-based coconut yogurt. Added strawberries, almond butter, granola. This is the one that I used, the Purely Elizabeth Original. Has really simple ingredients, it tastes so yummy. And then I did cinnamon and honey on top. I'm just heading out to the gym. I put on this blue set from Lululemon and then I have my same Aritzia jacket on. I'm gonna go do my leg workout today and just get that done. It's around three o'clock and then after that, I'm gonna go to Brandon's for dinner. morning you guys happy tuesday i just quickly got a little ready i put on some makeup and my hair is like still kind of curled from yesterday it looks a little crazy today but that's okay i'm just gonna go run a couple of errands and then i'm also gonna go to the gym so i put on my workout set just to wear this when i'm out i need to go run to tivoli village i'm gonna exchange a pair of brandon's shoes that he got for his birthday and a pair of pajamas and then i'm also gonna get a coffee i was thinking about working at a coffee shop for a little bit when i get coffee today i was texting brandon this morning and i told him kind of like what my plan was for the day and then he sent me ten dollars on apple pay and was like coffee on me today which is super sweet so i just put some oatmeal on the stove and i have that cooking which is pretty much done right now i just added a scoop of peanut butter so that is the breakfast today but i'm gonna eat and then get my things together so that i can leave i'm all ready to go so i just wanted to show you guys a quick outfit of the day black princess poly leather jacket over my green lemon set then i have on my new nikes which if you guys haven't seen them they're the nike zoom air fires and they're so cute i'm obsessed i'm gonna use this white bag i put all my stuff in here so it kind of looks cute and like all matches so sweaty right now you guys i went and did my back and biceps workout today i ended up switching my workouts because i'm gonna go to the gym with brooke on friday i went to donata boutique i ran errands and when i saw her there she asked if i wanted to work out with her on friday and she's gonna do her shoulders workout so i was like well i was gonna do shoulders today but i'll just do it on friday so we're gonna do shoulders chest and tries together and then we're gonna like get coffee or go to nectar or something so today i did back and biceps and then i also walked on the treadmill for 30 minutes i did 12 3 30 at the end so it's nice to just get some cardio in and then i went straight from the gym to the sauna because it's only like an eight minute drive it's like pretty close and i just would rather go back to back so that i can get all of my sweating out and then i can go home and shower and get ready so i'm feeling super good i did a lot of good things for like my physical health my mental health did the errands that i needed to do got my coffee at leon cafe in Tivoli Village and I really like their mugs and like the designs that they do on the drinks so I was like well I'm just gonna get a hot one but now I'm gonna go home and I'm definitely gonna shower I'm going to hot Pilates in the morning though so I'm not gonna wash my hair today I'm just gonna try to like blow dry it and 
recover it a little bit just because i'm gonna wash it tomorrow anyways i just talked to my dad him and my brother are back from alaska they just got home yesterday i don't really know when i'm gonna see them yet because they're in seattle if you guys are new hopefully i'll get to see them soon i know that my dad's gonna come out here because he has the house and then i think my brother will like eventually try to plan something i'm just really glad that they got all of their fishing done they made it home safely and now i can like talk to them more i was facetiming my brother too just like a little bit ago and i just like feel so happy when they get home like even though they're in another state i just know that i get to see them and the opportunity is actually there as opposed to when they're in alaska they're gone for three months and you know that you won't get to see them you don't really get to talk a lot i don't know i just like worry about them sometimes because it's obviously like a really scary job and it's really dangerous so when they're back i just have like a lot more peace of mind i'm just about to get on the freeway so it might get loud for a sec but i was just thinking about this because i was talking about what i did at the gym and i said i did 12 3 30 and lauren geraldo is pregnant which is so crazy i'm like so excited for her and i like literally just saw that so i was like oh my gosh i have to say something because if you guys don't know she's the creator of 12 3 30 or she like started the trend it's when you walk on the treadmill at a 12 incline on a three speed for 30 minutes she was saying that she's been like doing 12 30 every day during her pregnancy so i don't know if you guys follow her or not but she is like so funny and i love her youtube videos so i just have to mention that but i'm on my way home i'm gonna go eat maybe make a smoothie or something more think of these words as ways to encourage yourself to be intentional so that's what i wrote down for that all of the foam got stuck to the bottom, so I'm just going to put this on top. I had to use my almond milk because the oat milk is out. And this one froths just like a little bit different. It's 7.50 this morning and I'm about to leave to Hot Pilates. I got my class scheduled and I'm just about to eat one of the mush oats. These are my favorite thing to have before a workout. They're not too filling. They don't give me like a stomach ache. They give me energy for the workout and I'm having vanilla today because it's my favorite. <laughs> I had such a good workout class this morning, and then I stopped at Sprouts on the way home. I needed to get more oat milk, so I grabbed the oat milk one. And then I saw this drink, which sounded really good. It's the Vital Proteins Collagen Water, and it actually has 10 grams of protein in it. So we'll see how I like this. It's in the blackberry hibiscus. And then I grabbed two avocados. I was out of salt, so I just grabbed this pink Himalayan salt. I also grabbed these, which are the roasted red peppers. They're the chef's cut one. And I got these for a breakfast recipe that I want to make. You put pesto on it too with the peppers. Gotham Greens Vegan Pesto. It's made with fresh basil, extra virgin olive oil, and pine nuts. So I'm going to make that in a little bit. I got some micro arugula. And then I was out of blueberries. I also picked up this bread. It's the whole grain wide slice. And then lastly, I got some popcorn. I love this lesser evil one. And I usually get the Himalayan pink salt. But this time I got the Himalayan sweetness. It says sweet and salty blend with organic extra virgin coconut oil. So we'll see how I like that later for a snack. I just took a shower and I washed my hair and recurled it. Now I'm just going to do a little bit of makeup. I'm going to go run a couple of errands today. And I just felt like putting a little something on. This is the Say Beauty Slip Tint and I really like this product. I wear it in the shade three and a half. And I do feel like this shade is a little dark for me right now just because I'm really pale from it being winter. I try my best to like blend it down my neck but I probably should have just gotten a lighter shade. Now that it's like getting nicer out, Hopefully I'll get a little bit of a tan. I want to try to get outside more and walk outside, sit on my balcony, just like whatever I can to like get a little bit more vitamin D. Obviously wear sunscreen so that I can protect my skin. I forgot to put my hair clips in and I keep like pushing my hair back. So glad that I, whoops. Now I'm just going to do a little bit of concealer. I just like kind of blend it out. And then I let it sit for 
like a minute or so just so that it can start absorbing into my skin. I've been listening to Caitlin Nolan's podcast. It's called Not Your Typical and I really like it. I'm trying to get back into listening to podcasts. I feel like I always listen to them when I'm like on the treadmill or if I'm like walking outside, but I don't really listen to them other times. Like in the car, I've been listening to a lot of music or like in my apartment and I'm trying to get back into listening to them just like more regularly when like even when I'm at home because I do get really inspired and I feel like I learn a lot from podcasts and I just want to take in that kind of content like things that uplift me, make me feel good, motivate me. Now I'm just gonna do a little bit of blush. This is the Say Beauty one and I'm just doing like a tiny bit on my cheeks, my nose, and then my forehead. I'm just gonna take a little bit of setting powder. I like to use this under my eyes and I always do it after I've done all of my liquid products. I don't do this on my whole face, but just like where it mostly will come off. This is the Makeup by Mario bronzer in the shade medium and I really like it. For my bronzer, I just like to tap this product in and I try not to do like a lot. Right now I'm just frying one egg, cooked it in some avocado oil spray, and then put a little black pepper on there. I have three pieces of turkey bacon, which these are actually done. 